I wonder why you don't want to take anything in my house. No, don't worry, I'll take much like that. Okay? Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay. okay. Mom? Yes, darling. I'm off to a Stramora class. Oh. Okay, then. Come on. Mm -hmm. Yes, I'll see you when I come. Alright, take care of yourself for me, okay? Bye, oh, Daisy. My kid is gradually growing into a young man. I see. Still seems like yesterday mm. when I was almost driven out of my husband's house because I didn't have a child. They're all in the past now. You're right. Everything is in the past. <sighs> but I honestly think you are doting on him too much. just a kid and he's my only child so I'm just trying to give him all the care and attention any mother in my shoes would give I know but I'm not trying to teach you on how to train your child but the truth is I think you are giving too much free hand <laughs> you know Daisy I used to feel that way about some parents until I had my own kid Oh, I see. He's a child, and I'm only a spinster. Mm. Daisy, please, please, please. Don't um, talk about it that way. I know that as soon as you go to America to join your fiance, and both of you get married, you will just be nine months away from having your own child.
Ask for it. You can ask for some whatever you like. If I were wiser, I could have known that a woman without a child has no right to tell a mother how to raise her kid. <laughs> Daisy. Please, don't take it like that. I didn't mean it in that sense. Where is Okudele? He has gone to school. That's all right. I'll see him when he comes back. I hope there's no problem, darling. No, nothing that I can't handle. What does that mean? Excuse me. in the presence of my friend. What impression do you think you have created in her? I will do. I will say what I feel like being or saying in the presence of anybody. I don't have to pretend. What was that for? Who could it be? Who could have stolen my money? You see? That was why I wanted us to send him abroad to further his studies. If you had sent him to the US or the UK, would they have stolen your money? Igwe. Are you sure he stole your money? Hmm? Hugo. Okudele has lots of his own friends around here. And he doesn't need another one in you. So grow up and be a mother to him. Not a pal. What have I done now? Uh, have I said something I shouldn't have said? Why are you always insinuating that? I'm a bad mother. Forget what you think I'm insinuating. I didn't bury a dance. So I expect you to understand things better. Even for several years, I cried because of childlessness. And miraculously, Okudili came to wipe away my tears and prove to the whole world that I am not a barren woman. Have I uttered an abomination because I, I said that we should have sent him abroad to further his studies? Okudeli has not been able to finish his secondary school education like all his other mates around here while he's still under our care with us. Do you think he'll do better what he's done, sir? You always come up with these wonderful ideas of what you can do for him. And by the way, you are not uttering any abomination. But you should think of what you should do for him. Be a mother to him, but a back-patting buddy. When he comes back, 
I will do what I have to do. Children of today, the leaders of tomorrow. If you know to them, when it be monkey, when it come to. Oh. What's the problem? Oh What's the problem? I hope you're not having a problem with your husband. He thinks I'm not a good mother. Well, what made him think so? Yourself, okay? I, I can handle it. Are you sure? Exactly. Oh, nice, I forgot. Um, Jude called and he said he has finalized all the necessary arrangements and I'll be leaving for America. It's not our word. Spit it. Oh, yes. come here. <laughs> Thank you. I'm so happy for you. Oh, Thank you very much. <sighs> You will have a good marriage. Amen. God will not let you experience what I went through Amen. because I didn't have a child on time. Amen. 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 Oh, I'm so happy for you. Oh, thank you very much. So please don't cry again. No, I'm not. <laughs> Would you want me to write a check for the remaining 5,000 Naira? Or would you rather come back tomorrow and collect cash? Your Majesty, thank you very much. I'm very grateful. But um, I would rather come tomorrow and collect the remaining cash. Okay. Whatever happens, please do not let your daughter stop going to school on account of school fees. In this dispensation, we owe our children education. Something we must give to them. I'm very grateful, Ingo. I'm very grateful. God will bless you. It is unfortunate that those who went to school free and those who went on scholarship, who are now at the helm of affairs, do not see anything wrong with the astronomical amount of money Parents are forced to pay these days for the education of their children. It is very unfortunate. It's very unfortunate, Your Majesty. It's very unfortunate. And they don't want the poor people to go to school. If not, how do they expect someone who earns 120,000 a year to pay school fees running to hundreds of thousands of naira? But I know. How? It's unfortunate. We have to sacrifice for our children in the hope that they will make us proud by having something to show for it. Echeta, I am proud of your daughter. Igwe, I'm very grateful. Thank you, Igwe. I'm very grateful. I'm grateful, Echeta. Thank you. Thank you. Children of today, the leaders of tomorrow. If you not when it be monkey, when it comes to 
This is what I take every morning before coming to school. Mm -hmm. It makes me to be high. Mm -hmm. And when the teacher talks rubbish, I talk rubbish too. Oh. <laughs> oh, thank God that you brought it to school today. So I will enjoy it with you. Oh yes. My prince, give it to me. Let me see it now. Let me see it. Mm. Mm. Oh, I'm enjoying highness. I'm seeing things. And when the teacher asks for board mass, we'll give him algebra. Yes. That is it. But wait a minute, too. Won't your father ask for this bottle? <laughs> my father? Yes. My father that is not even sober enough to control his footsteps. Hey, wait. How do you think my father will know that he has finished this bottle or not? Then give me that gift, CP. What my father is talking about? <laughs> Let me have it, let me have it. Evans, I'll see you. I didn't feel it too much. I didn't feel that. Evelyn! Yes. Package, package. Evelyn. I wanted to know if you have gotten the reply of our last discussion we had. The reply is that I don't want to be running around with boys. Having two head of sexual transmitted diseases. Besides, I don't want to commit fornication. I only asked you yes or no question and not lecture. Would you like to be my girlfriend or not? Do you know what getting pregnant at this early stage of my life will do to me? Maybe you want us to justify the school fees we paid by answering academic questions. Where shall I? Getting pregnant will only make you a proud mother of a blue-blooded child. How's that? Okudle, oh, you're a jerk. You called me a jerk? Do you think you are better than those girls I have dated? Besides, you are not happy that you are dating a crown prince like me? Anyway, I get the things the way I like. And you Don't touch me again. What can I do for you? I would have been here in the morning, but I had to go and sell some wine. This has been happening for a while now. I know I can no longer take it. I thought I should come and report to the king. What is the problem? How can people be so wicked? They break the cake I use in collecting on wine. Who does that? They break the cake, drink the wine. That's the only way I can make money to train my children. No. But they can always deny me my sweat. No, no, that's wickedness. That is unfair. I think you should report to the king, all right? I know he'll do something about it. But, but have you been able to see anyone there? Fortunately, I saw them today. Thank God. And that's why I'm here. Thank God. I wonder why the prince and his friends will be doing this to me. Which prince? Your son. Otenku. When you were telling me all this, I thought you were referring to adults. How can you just cook up so much lies against children? What do they know? Your Majesty, he is no longer a kid. Are you his mother? So you now want to tell me how old my child is? Okay. If I ever hear this outside here, you will see the other side of me. I know you've been going around this kingdom telling people that the would be king has been stealing your pan wine. If I hear it from just one person, you will not like what I'll do to you. Sergeant! Your Majesty. Take him out of this compound. I told you the king doesn't see Paiwan Tapas today. Let's go. Children of today, the leaders of tomorrow. If you not when it be monkey, when it come to What I would do to that if she will regret it in her lifetime.
My prince, forget Evelyn. Evelyn is full of us shit. She thinks she's beautiful. She don't know that you are a prince, prince of this kingdom, a whole prince of Akuku kingdom. Oh yes. I don't know. What are you boys doing here? You should be in your classes. Trouble, trouble. And you, what are you still doing here? What do you think I'm doing here? What? Are you talking to me? You are a teacher and you are expected to know what I am saying. I will beat you black and blue if you are not careful with your ways. Who the hell do you think you are? Spending eight years in secondary school instead of six years doesn't give you the right to disrespect me. I guess to finish school in record time, but I know you are working for the money. Money is my swag. This is the money. Out of the hundred thousand naira I brought to school today, the remaining is this. You have it. You must pay for this insult. But if you don't leave this spot, you have yourself to regret. Get out. Are you talking to your teacher? Fuck you. You must regret it. Who? If you not when I'm when it be monkey, when it come to gorilla, now you will go chop. If you not when I'm when it be monkey, when it come to gorilla, now you will go chop. Train your beginner, train a mo, train a mo, train your beginner, train a mo, train a mo, train a mo, train your beginner. Children of today. The leaders of tomorrow. If you not train them, when it be monkey, when it come to gorilla. Driver, my prince. You will drop off my friend before we go home. Yes, your highness. Sir, where are we dropping them exactly? Oh yes, phase two, phase two. New quarters. My prince, those places are too wide apart from each other. Shut up. Are you tired of the job or what? No, my prince. You better be. My prince, we don't have enough well here to... If this car stops along the road, you will be in trouble. Besides, don't you know you will buy fuel in this car before you come? I'm sorry, sir. Good day, Your Majesty. I understand you teach in um, St. Michael's. Yes, Your Majesty. Why do you want to see him? Is my son all right? Your son is fine, Your Majesty. <sighs> I came with a letter from the principal. But the letter is for the king. Really? Let me have it. What is this supposed to mean? I believe you are the Lambert, right? Yes, Your Majesty. And I also believe that the essence of this whole letter is for my husband to kill my son. Because you and your principal deem it fit, right? It is not in that vein, Your Majesty. The letter is supposed to bring to your notice that the prince is taking too many liberties with the norms of the school. Whatever. Well, I have read what you said my son did. When he comes back, I'm going to ask him if he is guilty of what you are accusing him of. You may leave. Have a nice day, Your Majesty.
Okay, darling. Come home immediately. Okay. Please, I want to talk to you. What is it again, Okudle? You know what's going to my father's house and beat me? I'm not here to fight you. Besides, I'm sorry for what I did at school. I was just stupid because I was just trying to impress my friends. You are sorry? Yes, I am. Evening! Your father is in. I have to go now. He wants to go out. Evening, uh, I'll go in with you. Sorry, my father has message for your father. Stop it! You know what I'm doing. Let's just stop pretending and let's do this thing fast and get out do of here. Do what fast? Leave me alone. I will scream. Oh. You and I know that there is nobody in this house. Just calm down. Let's do this thing and get out of here. Nobody dares loves me. Are you mad? If you're not afraid of raping my sister in our own house, then be sure that I will not be afraid of killing you in this house too. Please, don't do that. Don't kill me. I'm Prince Okudele. And if you do, you won't go scot free Why don't you prince my foot? Because letting you walk out of this house alive is the only thing I would ever regret. Embarrassment. It will be weakness on your part if you let it, those people go like that. Okudele is very lucky to have got away with only a few bruises and a little embarrassment. Listen to what you say. Your only child was almost beaten to death. He ran home in his boxers. Instead of you to be asking for the heads of the idiots that did that to him, you're here telling me. He is just lucky. And what did your son do? Igwe, it does not matter what my son did. They don't have ah. any right whatsoever to do what they did to my son. If they were that aggrieved, they would have complained to us and we would have taken appropriate actions. The only appropriate action now is for you to let Okudli know that he has jump to write. And he'd better study for it. Jump. Okudili is not sitting for any jump. Uh. Yes. <laughs> you insisted he does his secondary education here. I accepted. But his university education, he is not going to do it here.
Oh, we'll do it. Oh, we'll do it. Why are you doing this to me? Mom, I'm not doing anything. Okudele, you were supposed to concentrate and finish your last papers. But instead, you chose to insult your teachers. Is it fair? Teachers? I only had problem with one teacher and he caused it. Well, that teacher brought a letter from your principal. If I had not stopped him, he would have given it to your father. And that would have caused another round of problems. Okudele, I know I don't want to lose you. But it, it hurts me when you do the things you do. Mom, I always do my best. I think it's people around me that do create this problem. I think they are jealous because you're a good mother to me. Simply because they don't understand me the way you do. Well, stay out of trouble and stay out of Otenko's palm trees. What? Yes, he was here. Mom, what is that saying about my traveling to Abraham? I'm still working on it. So it has come to this. Don't you know how to greet your elders? Even if we know, is it the ones that will greet you first? I wonder why they don't teach all these old men to mind their business. Can you imagine? Old man, just mind your business. Oh, please. This is an elderly man. We don't talk to him in that manner. Oh, Sita, what do you mean? I can do anything I like. I can do worse than this. Who was that? Hey, it's a pretty key. I pray him. Please forgive him. Please, Please forgive him, sir. He's just a kid. Why do you have to do that? I'm sorry for you. I know that your mother asked God for a son and she ended up having you. Eh, hey, 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 hey. don't even go to that aspect. Don't you ever talk about my mom here. Or I'll slap your back axe. Oh, Queen. You don't have to be too harsh on this old man. Ah. May God save your soul. Get out! But why? I mean, could you give an explanation to this? Why? I hate this man. He's among people that do come to the palace to give fake advice to my father. It's very irritating. Enough of this. Enough of this horse shit. Okay. Evans, let's get out of here. Mm. So, Big Sis, how is he, by the way? Huh. My son is finally through with secondary school. And by the grace of God, he will soon be going to the United States of America for his university education. Mm, really? I'm so happy for you. That's nice. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> but honestly, what I'm saying calls for serious attention. To be frank with you, I came here for us to have some time together and not to play a judge over a normal issue with mothers. Huh? So, as a spinster, I don't have any right to tell my friend that she's overindulging her child. There she goes again. Daisy, I chose to not understand you. How on earth can you say that 
I am over indulging on Koden. Listen, if your child was with me, I would still treat him or her the way I treat my own son. Mary Rico, where did I go wrong again? Hey, see. I know it be very, very difficult for you to understand. Mm. But I know that someday you will look at your child with love. And you will remember this day. And you will laugh at your inability for you to understand that special bond between mother and child. Mm? But, big sis, honestly, for real, you have to cut down the way you are treating that child. I mean, you are pampering him so much. Cut it down, please. Hmm. I read my case, so. Well, 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 I've heard, I've heard. Meanwhile, Daisy, I pray that the Almighty God will give you your own children ASAP. Amen, Amen to that. <laughs> Amen. Um, um, Daisy, please, I hope you'll be visiting us from time to time. Nice topic. Well, if the both of you like, don't come and visit me. So treat all your energy on your children and forget about me. Well, I don't have any intention of doing that. I don't know if I mean. Yeah, not for a chance. Well, today see and Jude and so many children. <laughs> Cheers. Mm, Cheers. I'm so happy. Take your own as Bluetooth. Okay. Take your chairs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Omis, I don't think. This is entirely bad news because no weapon fashion against our separation shall prosper. Amen! <laughs> you guys are fools. You don't really understand me. My father has money and whatever it takes to send me abroad. But he wouldn't do it. Why? Maybe he just wants his only son to be around him. Or is that what you think? Yes. So that he will learn on how to be a great king. Yeah. With all this strike that is going on, I might end up doing a four-year course for six years. People will think that I am stupid. I, I, I don't just understand. Whatever. I wrote the jump just to please him. You have a point, Okudele, my friend. But you should also understand that these old people have a way of thinking. They forget that they will always be like Methuselah, while we are like Solomon, young and wise. Evans! You are reasonable tonight! Look at what I have in my hand. Oh my God. You think I have this for nothing? <laughs> <laughs> it's giving me what I need. <laughs> save it, save it. Oh, this night is good. <laughs> mm. But let's tell ourselves the truth here. Nothing but the truth. Oku Dili's father. He's a good man. Yeah. If it was for a scholarship scheme, would have been in such an expensive noble secondary school. I believe you. But no but. Sebefe. Sebefe! Take off the ganja. The prince is off. Sebefe. <laughs> Did you look at this list before giving it to me? 
Yes, I did. So you honestly think I should buy him a car to use on campus? Iwe, he is a prince. And whatever he does, you know, tells a lot about your fame and fortune. Mm. I would rather he reflects not my fame and fortune, but my character and integrity. Honey, you insisted he goes to school here. Give him a little bit of comfort. Do you want him to be an object of ridicule? By the way, where is he? He should be the one discussing this with me, not you. Where is he? He went to see his classmates. In that case, this can wait until he comes back. I even know now. Please, why don't you just go through it? Let me know the ones I, I'll buy. Oh, that can also wait. There is plenty of time. Why are you making things difficult for me? Uh, we'll be done with this in a minute, then I'll go and do other things. Honey, if my food is ready, please let me know. Openly, as you can see, your mother has bought most of the things you need to go to school with. So there's nothing that holds you back from going to school tomorrow, right? Thanks, Dad. But will I be driving myself to school? Driving yourself to school? Do you know how to drive? Yes, Dad. And if I may ask, whose car would you be driving to school tomorrow? One of those cars parked outside. <clears throat> well, Okudile, son, I will not deny that you are my son. I will also not deny that I am ashamed of you. There are some people with ten or more children who bring them up and maintain them on a much less income than I. You are the only one in this family. And I cannot beat my chest and say to the world, here is my son. If you want my respect, Okudili, you have to earn it. It is after then that I'll begin to share with you cars, clothes, property, anything else. Here is the money for your school. Um, uh, but I remember now. So I will take out The 5,000 Naira you stole from me. So you are left with 45,000, which will have to suffice you for the period of the 50,000 Naira. Hi. You, you would have left the money. I thought you had forgotten about it. Mm. Tomorrow, my driver will drive you to school and bring back the car. Right. Okay. Right. Not to worry. You're not going to lack anything, okay? Come, let's go and finish our packing. Igwe, excuse us. Mary, when are you going to bring Ezube? As I'm speaking with you right now, 
Oku Deli is um, going to live in the campus. And I'm going to be all alone here. <laughs> Whoever tells you that she's going to miss you when she will be staying with her godmom, me. <laughs> I'll tell him. Oh, okay. Thank you. Bye. Okay. Uh -huh. Your Auntie Mary says I should um, greet you and tell you to be a good boy. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Remember everything I told you in the bedroom. Don't let me down. I won't. You know I love you. Yes, ma'am. And I love you too. I know. Make me proud, okay? Have they put your luggage in the vehicle? Do you know? Eche Zona! Eche Zona! Your Highness. Is his big suitcase in the vehicle? It's in the boot, ma'am. Oh, okay, okay. Let's go there. remembered that um, I am still in my jeweler and I had already promised him that I would pay him today with the hope that Okudeli would go and do that for me but he left without doing it. That's why you were screaming? <clears throat> Take it easier yourself please. You can always send somebody else to Take the money to him? You're right. Or oh, do I have a feeling that there is something in this to do with Okudele's departure? How do you mean? Well, being the first time he's away from home and all that. I have no doubt that he can cope without you. So please, take it easy. I will. Thank you, Yuki. I am sorry about that, but whatever punishment others receive should be meted out to him also. Thank you. Ibo, what is it? Who is it? Is it Okudeli? Shit! 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 Wait till you talk. Wait till you talk. 
Nah, Baba man, job don't knock, cool. guy, job don't knock. What are you talking about? Guys, job don't knock. Damn myself, eh? Wait, damn myself, now, baga. I did tell you. No, it's in talk. Say, make we met out the same punishment we met out before. And in fact, self, say this one, self, go be past other punishments when this guy don't receive. Which kind of nonsense be that, self? Guy, your papa call you bagger for phone, though. But wait, wait. Your papa hate to die, you guy. Wait till you do that, man, self. You didn't even ask questions. You just told the caller to give him the same punishment as others were given. Whom are we talking about here? Ukudele. Was that what I told you? Or were you also listening to what the caller said? Are you sure you are the real prince of Akuku land? Serious, I'm beginning to suspect you. Hey, what do you think? Guy, not true. Um, 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 see. What you go do now? That's the point. No mind that bastard with the concept saying to my papa. The guy just be, be taking myself in the house, boy. He don't understand the prince one of Akuku kingdom. He don't be doing anything. So the man they irritate me. But wait, to guy, wait. I got idea, guy. What if you call your mama? You don't say if you reason papa, papa no work. You can reason mama. Definitely, she gonna know what she gonna do. Oh boy! Yeah! Oh boy! I'm not even reason now. I hear now. Guys, why did you, you be like smart, you? guy? You're not supposed to be smart. Look at this one. This one's supposed to be the answer to Why are you the answer to <laughs> Because he's not the reason without his smart sense. Nah, for you. This is <laughs> my, this my brain, be not smart. for fans. Hi! Then we oh should boy. have called your mother now instead of wasting our eight time calling your father. I think you are right. Nana, you the reason through your own self. Yeah. <laughs> Nana, you the reason. So, you know what's going to happen? I will go call my mama. I will go call him. Guy, you need to dial the number. Call him. Call him. Yeah, put your one number. Take, take. Okay, so this is not work out, eh? <laughs> Guy, call this number. Guys, wait. Now, me make a call this number. Call yeah, I call wait, 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 see, see, call. wait, see. I don't say no darling, but wait, see, eh? If I call this number, eh? I'm maga let her pay. Thank see, you. two of una, three of us, we go share this money. Equal, equal. No cheat, no. Now, the enemy. Praise the talk, now. Anybody really work with me, they eat. Now, praise, now, praise. Praise of a cuckoo kingdom. You know, my dad say, you not praise, so. So you understand. Don't yeah, do this thing. Do the call. Car. I know they. No trust me, smart. Even get him on the phone. Huh? I can't get him on the phone. What do you want me to do? Did I ask him to go and join a campus scout? Or you want me to go again one more time and embarrass myself because I have a recalcitrant idiot of a son like Ogudele? I have done what a good father should do for his son and how does he pay me back Igwe, if you don't care about his welfare i do can i have the number of the security man who called you <laughs> they would have called you if they wanted to speak to his mother okudeli is a man I should be able to handle a couple of things like a man. I will not let them kill my son. I will not. Go to the gift begin, but in a man the train begin. My own sister. <laughs> 
You're welcome. Ah, you're shining. Mm, thank God. Uh, you're not looking brighter. What could be the problem? <laughs> you can go. Mm. <sighs> Is it not so good, eh? I don't know the problem he has in the school with some people. The security man called my husband. He said of my husband to look for a way to sort him out of the problem. He just told them to do whatever they did to the others to him. What is that supposed to mean? Oh. I mean, not when I'm still alive. Uh, call him, let's... He's, he's even calling me. Okay. Okay. Yes. What did he say? That he had to beg the security men to allow him to make this call to me. They're asking for money to release him. How much is the money? And what did he do? Mary, I will just give him the money and ask him to come home. It is said to them, cheer up. Please, look for something and give to your sis. I'm famished. Okay. What can I offer my sister? Anything. Please. <laughs> I told you that the money is going to come and we're going to have a very big party. Oh boy. You have a very variable oil well at home, guy. And it tells you this is called oil resource control, guy. <laughs> Guys, you have not seen anything yet. Guy, how come your prophecy can't hate you like that? Come on, the fuck up, bro. And it tells you, serious, that man is a bastard. If you think this man don't deprive me for my life, many assets will don't deprive me. So that I don't even come to the meeting for anything. If not because of my mom, see where they give me all these things. See, guy, seriously, your mother loves you so much. Real good. And it tells you, don't want to try. But Baba, man, guy, come to think of you, too. This guy, I'm the only son for the family, guy. And the papa get money, die, their family, all of them get money, die. But they don't feel spread around the guy here. Why? Eh? Is this. Uh, uh, is it meant to be? Uh, guy, when I will make the last call. They will feel say I'll be Prince one of. I will give him the papa and the tells. She need to pick the call. Let's pick her home. So you're gonna pay, you're gonna pay. Please! 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 I am disappointed, Bank 
the kind of life he's lived in this institution. As a matter of fact, uh, he's supposed to be a shining example to his fellow students. But unfortunately, he's the reverse. A prince. A future king. As a matter of fact, the decision to expel him has the unanimous support and approval of the entire university senate. I had always hoped he would be a better person. But I didn't know it had got to this extent, to the point of expulsion. <sighs> right from the time he stepped into this institution, he has been creating problems, been involved in all kinds of scam, admission, rape, gangsterism. As a matter of fact, um, the other day there was a shooting incident that nearly cost the life of a fellow student. He was involved. And we have zero tolerance, zero tolerance for such misbehavior in this school. I'm sorry. Prof, it has taken all that makes me a man to be here in the first place. And I'm not particularly proud of what my son has done. I wouldn't want to bore you with the litany of all that I have done as a father to correct his ways. All to no avail. Still, Prof, I would plead that you give him just one more chance. Just one more chance. Your Majesty, you know, there's nothing I can't do for you. We've come a long way. I have great respect for you. But at this, as far as this matter is concerned, the Senate has taken a final decision. He has to go. Not even when I have come myself physically to plead? <sighs> I'm sorry, Your Majesty. I'm very sorry. Thank you. What exactly do you want from me, Okudele? You have disgraced me within and beyond the borders of this town. Okudele, why are you doing this to us? Can't we have peace as your parents? What haven't we done for you? We have given you everything you have ever asked for. Exactly. You have always had both the things you should have had and even the things you should not have had. I want to die a peaceful death, not one of regret and heartbreak, because I have a son. I'm sorry, Dad. You don't know. I'm not sorry. I will know where you are sorry, and that is where you begin to behave like a sane human being. Honey, please, take it easy. You're beginning to get worked up and it, it's not good for your health. I know what is good for my health. And that is when this young man, this boy, begins to behave like a normal human being. Anyway, Okudele, I have decided to give you one more chance. And that is by sending you abroad to complete your studies. Yes, you may grin now, but you better not come back to this house, a rascal, after all the sacrifice I'm going to make. Okay, now you may go. Igor, that's my dad. 
America, here I come! <laughs> America, here I come. Uh, America, you great! <laughs> Thank you, Daddy. Thank you. Now go to the gift, begin. But in a man, the train begin. You're picking the loss. If you don't give them discipline, yeah. Over love, over pampa. This boy begin, no forget. If begin, mess up. Fire up for Nash. He had to go correct. That's right. Train up. Train your begin. Train up. Train your begin. Children of today. The leaders of tomorrow. If you not train them, when it be monkey. When it come to gorilla, now you will go chop. If you not train them, when it be monkey. When it come to gorilla, now you 